<laughs> oh man. This feels good. Now that I got it off my chest, I feel so much better about this Goku Black because I know he's garbage. <laughs> he is one of the few units I've ever read off their passive and said it's actually a fair chance they changed part of his passive. Like, it's only happened, I'd say, like two, maybe three times in the entire time I've... I, I can't even think of it. Like, even before... Nah, this has only happened two or three times in Dokkan's lifespan, at least notable times, where they updated a unit's passive details after twi tweeting out their details. Like, it does not happen often. He is that bad. I actually think it's funny, but we're not here for him. I'm done with him for the night. I don't want to talk about him. Um, This is more of him. It's not what I care about. Okay, anyway. <laughs> the EX skill orb, I'm not sure. I, I would assume it's just for the trunks, but I'm not sure. Maybe it's for the S. Or by the, I'm, I can't even say trunks. I got to say typings and, and sagas. And Anyway, I would assume it's for this domain free-to-play trunks, these EX key, skill orbs exclusively, but it says characters plural, so maybe... The STR Rage Dragon Ball Super Trunks is also going to get his own skill orbs. I'm not sure. We'll see how they handle it. But uh, it's nice that they're doing this. It is very good. I do think, you know, his EZA has potential because his domain looks like it's going to be very good. We'll see what they do. I do want to see... I want to see how easy A's, how much they seem like they might affect domains. I mean, right now, yeah, Super Class does 10% more attack and defense. Or no, I'm sorry. It's extreme class takes 10% more damage, right? You guys know. And I'm hoping they bump that up to like 15, 20. If it stays the same, that would actually startle me because that means whenever they drop future domain units, which knowing these worldwide mechanics, they literally, they'll, they'll make these mechanics and never use them again. It's really weird. Costume change, the exchange mechanic, like not lit. I shouldn't have said literally. They'll make these mechanics and then the mechanics will just go to the wayside for extended periods of time. I'm assuming they're going to do this with the domain mechanic, but I'm really hoping they don't because I think it's such a dope idea. We'll see how they handle it. Anyway, he has EX skill orbs on the way. He is going to EZA. The Rage Trunks is going to EZA. They're both on the way, man. Don't worry about that. Now, the Red Zone. The Red Zone is getting Stage 5, which is going to be Merge Zamasu. My concern is if they're dropping Stage 5 tonight, and it, well, not tonight, I'm sorry. They're dropping the reveal, the teaser for it tonight, and, and this is like just fully merged like this isn't even in pure zamasu this is just like i don't know divinity incarnate whatever he wants to call himself justice incarnate that's him right there are we not getting in the infinite zamasu stage i would think they're dropping a sixth stage right they have to be dropping a stage number six i can't be tripping we'll see we'll see we'll see what it is but i do expect this fight to be incredibly difficult this will not be a light fight at all we will be in a brawl we'll see what it is man it is it's it's gonna be hell it's gonna be hell i'm not gonna be shocked at all if it's better than the rose i i've heard people say and i get it i definitely get it with this one they're saying that this red zone is just a each one is just a buffed version of the last phase or the last stage i'm sorry and it's just creating the same stage over and over again copy and pasting it but then buffing the stats is what it feels like in it's short all short phases none of them are long fights none of them have like some crazy gimmick or anything they just hit super hard and you better be ready as soon as possible i get that i mean the androids kind of had one because they key nullified right but i get the idea of what you guys are saying however i do think these fights have been extremely fun and i do think that on global i cannot speak for jp but on global i do think these are the hardest fights like starting with cell then going to goku black then going to zamasu and goku black and now i think this merge zamasu will be the hardest fight in the game i do think that str vegito blue is up there but you can get around him because you can lower his attack Along with where, I don't know where it is. Let me go find it. All right, here we are. Shout out Celtic Link. Appreciate it. Um, here we are. We have the support memory boost. This is good because it's coming to global, of course. But it's just nice to, like, when I see it in the global news, it automatically takes away any concern of, is it coming to global too? I don't know. It's just that trauma, man. It's in there. Anyway, stage, is it stage three? 
I think it's stage three. A new stage is coming for the support memory boost. I'm assuming you're gonna use a whole bunch of future characters. We're getting the extreme Z area. Like I said, the STR Trunks is gonna get his easy A. Of course, we knew that from the jump. I do like the fact that these extreme Z areas are always conditioned around like, you know, the category or whatever. And they just keep stacking on top of one another instead of like easy A's, which are all independent events, right? In the easy A tab, does that make sense? And so, like, for example, look, this Trunks could have easily been in the other one. But no, no, they made sure he was sectioned off into the Android Cell Saga free-to-play EZA area. That's very good. Now, it's not that serious. It's just my OCD. I'm terrible. Okay, now the Mortal Will. Where is it? Where is it? A new stage. Stage 10 will be added. Lamination of the Absolute God will become available. Here is a support memory for Zamasu. This is when he's crying. I don't even care about him crying. I just need to make sure I can see Vegito's face when he, like, dude, are you crying? I need that. I need that. In fine and super high HD quality. But we won't be getting that, will we? Anyway, a mortal will. Where's the mortal will? There it is. Cool. Appreciate it, Celtic. So, Divine Wrath and Mortal Will will be getting stages 8 and 9. The Goku Black is, I would hope, I can't even say I expect, but I would hope is going to be good for at least fighting Trunks because I expect Trunks to be physical since he's clearly going to be based on the LR and things like that. Things like that would, like, Goku Black can't, let me stop talking about that guy. So, yeah, stages 8 and 9 are going to come out. I would be really you know, pleased, I mean, I'd be at peace, I guess, if these fights were the two hardest fights in the game, that wouldn't bother me at all, because we need a super class fight, which Vegito Blue is on that level, but we need a super class fight that's undeniably one of the hardest fights in the game, and we need that consistent, like, we need it multiple times, you can't do it one time and let it just go from there for months at a time, I can't remember the last, I mean, the Gamma 1 and 2 fight, uh, sure, I guess, I guess, I can't remember the last time a fight before Vegito Blue was considered the hardest fight in the game at the time, and it was super class, because even when Gamma 1 and 2 came out, would I say it was harder than Cell Max? Yeah, I guess, because they had the boosted characters at that point, but... You get what I'm saying, right? So Trunks being, you know, who he is, this will be good for a lot of characters, a lot of the villains that want to be in those environments. It's good for balancing the content in the game. It's a different way. It doesn't matter how you feel about it. If you think it's not that serious, it affects the game. It affects the way your units take damage and deal damage. It's, it affects the way a lot of passives for units that have died off or maybe are on a down, you know, descent. And a lot of units that are on the way that we don't even know exist yet. A lot of those units are based on they want to fight super class. They want to fight extreme class. They, they want to fight specific character names such as Turles. These things matter. So we haven't taken advantage of the Turles one yet. Which actually, thinking about it, if Vegito Blue, if he started out as the AGL Goku and Vegeta, I'm pretty sure that would have triggered Turles' intro, physical Turles' intro. That would have been really nice for that fight. I mean, he would have got obliterated, right, by STR Vegito Blue. I'm just saying. It would have been nice to at least be able to see it. <laughs> no, but seriously, I'm going to leave all of that there. It is the Young King Hitman. Red Zone is on the way. I am tired of getting blasted by these stages. These stages have been giving me hell, man. The Mortal Will event is whatever, but these damn Red Zones? Oh, my gosh. Young Hitman. Shout out everybody I used in the shout out Pat, shout out Minato, shout out Toonrami, shout out Celtic, appreciate you guys, shout out the Dokkan Wiki. It's a damn shame. I would say shout out Dokkan and shout out Akatsuki, but they should be ashamed of themselves. So Hitman is off this.